Runway Roy. Ah, oh, God. Money, power, spit. It's the key to life. Are you giving me stuff? Do I need a value set? I don't. If you were to ever meet me in public, you ain't gonna get this. It is not anyone's responsibility. <laughs> Good morning, or what up? I just came back from carpool, got my tomorrow head tie on from Amazon. I'm gonna link it below, I'll link all my stuff below. FYI, in case you're ever looking for something. About to go on a Peloton or whatever. I have two meetings this morning, one of which is actually with a Sephora squad sister. I'm gonna talk to her a little bit, and then I have my therapy meeting at 10 o'clock. I'm gonna work out right now for 30 minutes on the Peloton before I go shower and then do my makeup and like the two meetings and then I need to go get my car inspected for registration renewal and then I wanna I'm gonna take your advice I'm gonna go and get my pedicure just for the relaxation and also to get that gel it's just like why not you know give myself a break why not had a fantastic at home photo shoot yesterday it came out oh the music oh my gosh i hope that you don't hear this music jesus okay we'll move on because the music is on and i now worry that copyright Ooh! I already showered and did my skincare. I'm about to have my meeting. Because my skin is still healing. Okay, so here's the thing. Okay, a lot of things. I'm gonna put oil in my hair. I don't like when my hair looks dry. You know, natural hair looks best when it's hydrated looking. So I'm gonna put some oil on my hair and then also lay it down a little bit more, the edge part of it. So because I was using my treatment a lot more than normal because I wanted to speed up the recovery of my skin, the treatment is going to dry out the skin. That's just what it does as it clears out the inflammation and clears out the pores. Well, my face is feeling very dry, more dry than normal, which I'll take because my skin has healed like 90, 92%, which I will take because I was just sick and tired of that. So my skin is is whatever okay i'm gonna put oil on my I, I i wanted to find like a cute you know like a cute oil like a moroccan something cute but in my drawer right here i don't have it and i don't feel like getting up so i'm gonna just take this wild growth hair oil first of all it was leaking in my container my drawer can't even stand it mad annoying it was leaking but we gonna get it together i've been using this you know what i'm saying it's not necessarily i use this for my edges but right now i really just want this whole area to be shiny you know natural hair looks best when it's shiny not dry relaxed hair a little bit of shine but like you don't want to be greasy looking when your hair is relaxed but when it's natural dryness looks tacky Hi. so this is day two of this hair it's still look good to me you let me know i'm gonna hairspray it down we got to be hairspray and it should, right, because I could do edge tamer, but I don't want to do that. Let me do a guy. Let me put a little bit of actual got to be and do that. I just changed my mind. I'm going to use regular got to be. Yo, on the Peloton, she was playing Lil' Kim and DMX and stuff. Money, power, spit. It's the key to life. I was like, yo, <laughs> don't pack. <laughs> Don't book. Yo, here's the thing. <laughs> here's the thing. Like, anyone who knows me understands. Like, knows me in real life and knew me before I came to know the Lord. Like, you get it. This is not. This is not. This ain't. This ain't news to you. Like, what is that? Like, you know? So, all the things. Anyway, what time is it? Oh, I got to hop on a phone call with her. Hold on. We're going to talk on not Facebook, IG. And so while we're talking, I'm going to do my makeup so that I am ready to go so that when I hop on my therapy session, I'm going to have my wig on. My therapist is so funny. I mean, she has seen 
this might be a lot of product, but maybe not. You know, she has seen a lot, <laughs> and she's so sweet. When she sees me dressed up, she's like, oh, you look lovely today. <laughs> and you're like, hi. <laughs> yeah, I gotta go. This is so sick. Okay. Can't even do it. Oh, I should have sprayed the back. Not the back, but the top. I can't do it. I cannot do this. What a bum 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 de lum bum 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 de lum bum bum. What a bum bum. Hey, what a. Oh, I gotta soak my sponge. Watch my video about makeup sponges. Soak your sponge. Soak your sponge and then squeeze it through. Let me go soak my sponge before I start so I can have all I need. Ooh. You're all I need to get by. Hi. You're all I need. And you, I spend my time. I dedicate my life. I'll sacrifice for you, dedicate my life to you. I got a love tone for your body, your skin tone. <laughs> Woo! Oh, I wish I could do this from my computer, but you can't do that. Is that a problem with me? <laughs> That's a big issue for me. You know what I mean? I'm like, why? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hi. Hi, 9 a.m. Let's go. Good morning, good morning. Oh, well, thank you for asking. Business is going well. It, it's it's steady. It's gonna start picking up for the holiday season. <laughs> They get scared when I open the door right on them. I'll be like right here. Thanks so much. Ooh, I smell that. I can smell my fragrance. What's on? Not me smelling. What did I just spray on? Why do I smell so good? It's my Brazilian Boom Boom Cream. What in the whole? Oh my God, I'm about to squish this with the box. It's a little... Not me smelling so good, my Brazilian Chirosa. Yo, you open a door and what kind of bugs be coming in? I hate that. Okay. Not my two packages. Let me just kick this thing over because I can't. I can't even do it. Yo, this hairstyle is me all day. Like, I need to just live in this hairstyle. Let me show you my robe. Hold on. Because mommy got a robe on today. And when I say mommy, it's M A M I. Ooh, it's giving dark. It's giving too dark. It's giving bad lighting. <laughs> I'm gonna show a little bit of lag. Hello. We young and fine. Hi. Hi and hi. Love this robe from Amazon, baby. You need it. You need everything. <laughs> everything I'm buying every week. <laughs> you need, like literally. <laughs> Yo, this is my hairstyle. I posted it on IG or whatever. I love this color because it's got the brown, what is this, color 30 or color 4? Something like that, whatever. It's 1B4. I gotta go fix my post. I wrote that it was 1B30. I get so confused. There's so many colors, it's too much. This is 1B4. This is 1B4. I like this. Comment, let me know if this is my signature hairstyle. Do you, excuse me, do you feel like this is my signature hairstyle? I do. Hi. I'm just feeling myself today. I just feel like we should feel ourselves at all times. It's a non-negotiable. It's a must. So, uh, excuse me, Alexa, stop the music. Cause you are not gonna get me demonetized. <laughs> we ain't doing that today. Let me turn my heat off so you can actually hear me in the name of Jesus. Look at let me find out we got. <laughs> 
a package from Charlotte Tilbury. Hi. Y'all be sending me stuff? I see you. You know I'm working. I'm working. But a package came in. So, like, how am I not going to want to open it? I don't know what's going on. Nude lippies. Hi. Hi. Okay. I have this mascara. I need to try it. Do I have, I have a little stash on my desk of things that I'm going to try. I, do I have a, ma I have a, yeah, this is a mascara. So I'm not going to put this one here. I will use this another time. Try it out. We got new lipsticks. I have a few nudies from Charlotte. Actually, part of what's here that I'm going to try in a video is a Charlotte nudie. It's Pillow Talk. Hi. And this is, when I open this stuff, I open it so rough. So when you get it in the giveaways, which I always do, comment below. The giveaways are random. I know I do see your messages. Y'all you, you, be like, I've been here for a minute. I haven't won a giveaway. There are 115,000 of you on IG and 20,000 of you on YouTube. I know there are a lot of you that always comment that have not won a giveaway. It's not intentional. It is very much random because I would hate for anyone to feel like it's it's like, you know, okay? But I do see you. Please don't be upset because if you ask highest, it was highest if somebody else was like, nobody else giving y'all stuff. Either they're selling it to you or they ain't giving it to you at all. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm just saying, go easy on the kid, okay? Go easy on the kid. Ain't nothing specific you need to do. Just go ahead and organically engage with the kid. That's it. You know, you want to be here? I appreciate it. Just be organic, you know? Be be organic. This is a cute color. It kind of looks like what I have on right now, but what I have on right now is peach-ish. This is cute. Run, right, run. Look at me, the accent. Gotta bring it out. Run. Run, way, Roy. Ah, God. Run, Ray. Oh. How do you say it? Run, run. The, the place that models walk on. Run. This is more, mm, more reddish, pinkish. I don't want this color. This is not gonna be for me. I like my lips to be light in the center. That's just like my vibe. It looks so good on me. I love it. This one ain't gonna be for me. This one gonna wanna give away. It's beautiful though. Supermodel. Runway royalty. Wow. That was a tongue twister. Runway void. Ha! God. <laughs> God, I have a lot of emails. How? Ooh, ooh, this is well, okay. I was gonna say this is looking real light, real beige. But I can make this work with a brown liner though. <laughs> it's giving sis from MAC vibes. I'm going to try this one out because it looks real cute. Say it. Tell me if you know how to say it. Because, you know, when it comes to the accent, I have, I have a few. Someone told me this one time. And I appreciate it. Y'all paying attention and stuff. I have a few accents. You know, when you pay attention for a, a quick second, you're going to get a lot of accents out of me. This one is, mm, this one is cute. I want to keep the cuteness. I don't want to swatch anything right now. You're going to have to wait. You're going to just have to wait. You're going to just have to wait. It's going to be so good. Like, just wait until I use the stuff. Like, just wait, you know? Somebody pointed out one time. They were like, you have a few accents. I was like, you know what? Now that you say it, now that you have my voice going very high, giving myself lightheadedness. What is this? A liner. Oh, it's for the lips. We have chocolate and we have what in the world? What is this brightener? Wait, is this for the eyes? Hi. Reading is fundamental. I don't, mm -mm. I'm, I'm, I'm the open the box, start putting it together before I even look at the manual. That's me. So I'm just like, what? Is this for eyes? Oh, this is brown liner for the eyes. I might put the brown liner on my lip though. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, this is for the eye. That's cute. Thank you. Thank you, Charlotte Tiberi. This is a little impromptu unboxing. What is this bronze? Ready to bron what? Runway? <laughs> Here we go. Here we go. It's them words again. It's them words again. You know I have a few accents. That's just how I am. God made me multifaceted. I have a lot of facets. <laughs> Multi. Multi. Okay, it's like all the things. What is this? This looks beautiful, but this ain't my color though. Oh, that one, not gonna work for me. The other ones look really cute, but for me, I'm like, I don't wanna just keep 
a palette just to use like two things out of it. So this beautiful thing, go and go on that giveaway. And let me also say something. When you want to give away, it's very random. In order for my own mental health and my own safety and my own safety, like I'm in a, like I'm, I'm in a, a construction camp. Because I can't take requests. I, I'm just too busy. I just can't, you know? I prepackage stuff. And you know my corner right there. I prepackage it. I have different sizes. And it's just there. And then when I give the giveaway addresses, I print out a label and I put it on something. So I don't know what's in those boxes. I've packaged them months ago or weeks ago or whatever. I don't know what's in there. It's a whole bunch of stuff, you know? You might find stuff in there that don't match you. You see, that's when you go ahead and be a blessing to somebody else. And you pass it on to your friend, your neighbor your co-worker, your postal worker, your cafeteria lady, anybody you can find that you think might use it. You see what I'm saying? That's when you go ahead and you be another extension of a blessing. Praise his name. That's your opportunity. You know what? Because I have a, I have one of these shows. I already said I have one of these. I'm going to put this in a giveaway too. That's your opportunity. I cannot take requests because it's really too much. So don't get upset if you get something that'll match you, baby. By all means, I mean, after all, it was free. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I don't get it. It was free, baby. You see what I mean? Okay. What is this? Oh, we got an eyeshadow palette that is not going to work for me. This, I can make like one or two colors work. But because of that, and I have overload, I would much rather share this, pass this on to someone that could quite possibly, I don't know, you might get it and it might not work for you. But then again, you go ahead and be a blessing to someone else. And just pass it on. So this is going to go on the giveaway too. But I really appreciate it. I cannot wait to use these lippies, baby. And the eye pencil. All right. Oh, right. I got another package too. But I'm over here in the middle of doing something. I'm annoyed. Like, we can't ignore that. Because that is a fact. Did I buy stuff from Sephora? What did I buy from Sephora? What's, what's Sephora giving me? What are you giving me? Hi. What are you doing? Are you giving me stuff? Who's, who's on? Who's on? Oh, you giving me stuff, Sephora? Who's my? Hi. Wait. What we doing? You just over here giving me free stuff? How you know I like free? Sephora is launching a favorites kit to support Black-owned brands launching on 914.com only. The kit contains makeup, skincare, and hair products from Black-owned brands that Sephora believes in stands by goes back to time and time again the kit retails for $35 and it has a hundred and twenty four dollar value ow ow wow I did not know I was getting this you can't okay first of all who do who do you know who do you know that can at the drop of a dime make music who do you know you don't know anybody that can make music at the drop of a dime or that can do it and snap her fingers on only one hand in a continuous fashion, on beat, on call, per diem, overnight shift. It's, a, it's something, it's something, it's something. You gotta celebrate, you gotta, you gotta give props where props are due. That's just what it gotta be. Let me find out Sephora got a favorites box for black owned beauty brands. Who's on? Hi. Do we see this? Wowzers. It's giving, uh, what did I used to be? Boxy charm. It's giving boxy but black. Blacksy charm. I'm into all of it. 15, excuse me, 15% pledge. We got full size lipsticks in here, full size Fenty. We got Shani Darty. We got Brio Gio. We got Draw Beauty. I draw Ghana stand up. Ah, Fenty Beauty. Oh, how cute. In the box, you get a full size, but I like this though. Look at this. Oh, I, you know what? I do have some of these already. I don't want to give them to these to you though. <laughs> I'm so irritated. These are so cute. Like mini versions. How cute. This is what I was looking for earlier. The full size version of this Bread Beauty Everyday Hair Oil is in my bathroom. This morning when I want a hair oil from the front of my hair, this is what I wanted. So now I got it. It's like they knew I needed this, but UPS came mad late. Like you should have been here an hour ago. So I could have used it today, but I couldn't have. But that's okay though, because I'm going to need to oil her again tomorrow, you know, because this hair not going to go through the weekend. You know, maybe even next week, because that's how much I'm feeling her. 
Hi. I'm going to put this right here in my drawer because this is a little hair drawer that I have right here. Need. Very much need. Uh, oh, this is so cute. Yo, actually, the video I posted this week on my story, where, my page where I was doing this hairstyle, re, was it a reel? Is I posted a reel. I used a Joie Beauty leave in conditioner. This is a deep conditioning treatment. I was using a pump version of a leave in conditioner. It's the same Bois Mint. Bois Mint? It's, no, it's, it's Bois, Bois Mint. Yeah. It smells so good. My God, today. Like, what? And it leaves that menthol feeling on your scalp. Ooh, very rejuvenating, almost like a eucalyptus. I'm so annoyed, like very much. Briogeo, don't repair, don't despair. Go ahead and repair. Deconditioning mask. I got two conditioning masks. Hair gonna always be conditioned. I wanna get a flat iron. Let me know if you're natural. Okay, and let me know if you've ever gotten a deep, uh, what's it called, a silk press. How did it go? I want to get it. I want the weather to cool down a little bit. I'm not trying to deal with too early of a reversal. Ooh, this is a cute color. It's on the morph pinky side. This is, I wish it was more peach, but that's okay though. This is Pat McGrath. Okay, and this is looking real powdery, real delicious. I have a lot of lipsticks and not a lot of lips. I don't like lip swatches because they're a lot of work. You must be mad dry after you finish. It's mad annoying. Shani's already written. I have the big version of this, so I'll give this away. It's a sample. It's a sample. I love a good sample. Okay. And we got a full size frontal, full frontal, full, yep, full frontal because I'm black Fenty mascara. I have this. It's finished because I used it. I did enjoy it. It wasn't fantastic. I am in love with the Lawless one that you know that I love right now because it's fantastic. I'm also using the Kish Kush one on my top lashes because I try not to waste. I'm going to give this away because I already tried it and I, you know, why waste? Oh, this is so cute. Thank you, Sister Four, for surprising your girl with a with the black owned beauty brands box. This is gonna be live on their page on the dot com on 9-14. That's September 14. The kit contains makeup, skincare, hair products from black owned brands that Sephora believes in. You should add candles to this box, but there are no, oh no, Forever Mood does have the minis. Go ahead and extend it to the minis, just like black folks, right? You get some, you wanna get more. Go ahead and add some candles to this Sephora. Go on, give us some candles too, cause you know I burn a candle every day. <laughs> I, I wouldn't mind another one. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. Listen, I need to finish what I'm doing right now so I can go put on my clothes because it's Friday and I'm ready to swing. I'm gonna go get my nails done tonight because I decided to go and get a pedicure. I'm gonna let them put the white gel on my toe. Wow, I'm doing well. We have elevated our ability, you know, to think on the think on the dime, you know, to think on the 10 cents. You see, I think it's fantastic. Listen, don't be fooled. If you were to ever meet me in public, you ain't gonna get this. You're probably gonna be like, that's not the same in a on the vlogs. No, it's not. I can't be like this all the time. It's exhausting, okay? <laughs> I gotta take breaks, okay? So that's the thing. Like, if you know me, this ain't it all the time, no ma'am. Mm -mm. I can't do it. I be getting tired. Ex introverts, we get tired. We get exhausted. It's very exhausting. It's a lot. You know, it's a lot. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> get it to fade and go away. And wearing sunscreen is one piece of the sun protection package, in which case they can give you laser, in some cases a chemical peel, but you have to be very careful because these areas that I've just mentioned, they're very... Ouch, I just hit my, <laughs> oh my God. I just hit my ponytail on the top of my car. I'd like a pedicure, please. Yes, of course. How long is the wait? That's not right now. Oh, all right, perfect. 
And your name on top. You pick out what pedicure you want for me. Appreciate it. Okay. Yo, this is my jam. Not me in a cop who's bumping Foxy and Baby Sham. I just got home adding these to my bag as my touch-up kit when I'm out. So I had I forgot I had an extra lip bar savage. Then Maybelline Hazelnut Super Matte Ink Lip Ink. Then Brownie from JP lip liner. And then a red. I don't wear red often, but just in case I'm out and I have a red on and I need to touch it up, this is what I'll put on top. Doesn't matter what shade of red I have on. I'll put that on top. And then a gloss in case I'm a little dry. You know, I need a little moisturization. I put this one in there. And this bag you've seen before. It's what I have my makeup in and my situation. LMS sent this to me with some products. You've seen this if you've watched my vlogs before. That is that bag. And then you've seen my what's in my bag video. So this is in here. This bag got mad stuff in it, okay? That's not what we're here to talk about. We just here to figure out and understand that the bag got what I need. I got what you want. I got what you want. I got what you need. <laughs> it got all up. It got everything I need up in here. Period. All right. I got a little dilemma. Something fell behind my drawer and it's preventing me from clo What in the world? Why not? Okay. And it's preventing me. First of all, I love my pedicure. My feet feel so soft. Preventing me from closing my drawer. So I took this out because I have to unscrew. This is a very miscellaneous drawer with lots of tech type random things in it. I have to unscrew the side and side to take this drawer out to get the item and then screw it back. A little tedious, but that's okay. Alrighty. Hold on, wait, how do you do this again? How do I take this out? Oh, this is what I can't stand about these. How did I even do this? How did I even, do I forgot how I did this. Oh, it's from the inside. Oh. Okay, but you could have said that. Like, ugh. Okay, so it's from the inside. Oh, God. Okay. And I, you know, I could take all these things out, right? Oh. Who wants to do all of that? <laughs> oh, ah. We did not yet how. We did not yet how. This is really making me hot. Especially with this, with this wig on. <laughs> not a wig, but you know. <sighs> I called hair a wig, okay? <laughs> Hi. Hello. Why is this happening? All right. I should take off this jacket, huh? Okay. Wow, was this even screwed in? It looks like it wasn't even screwed in. All right. It's a head scratching thing, too, that I got in PR. That I thought was a good idea to put in here, but obviously it's a terrible idea. Okay. Is it gonna come out? Is that is that all that it will take? Are there two? Are there two? God, I gotta take this wig off. Are there two parts of this? How am I gonna take this drawer out? I gotta get this drawer out. Hold on, I can't even see. Are there two parts of this? Oh God. How do you, you know, I don't have the manual. And when I put this together, I had an idea. I knew what I was doing, but I don't know what I'm doing now. Okay. Okay, so. <laughs> Because if I don't take this out, this drawer can't close. Oh my God, okay, I did take it out. See, huh, you see it? <laughs> that freaking scalp scratcher fell in the back and I couldn't close my drawer, so annoyed. Like, why are we doing this right now? Ugh. Oh my God. Show up, like, what is this? What's happening in the world? Okay. <laughs> Amazon and absolutely love because they're sugar free. It's emergen. I mean, excuse me. I almost said emergency. It's airborne. One pack is 500 milligrams of vitamin C. So I take two of these. I also have like melt on your tongue type tablet things that I take too. But I like these a lot because it tastes really good. Very important, obviously, for cold and flu season. But just in general, just in general. Let me know if you try this. It's really good. What up, yo? Good morning. So check this out. I just do my hair. But I ain't about to do that right now. 
<laughs> that's why I got this hoodie on. The front is flaky, you know, which is to be expected with the hairstyle that I had. Like, hello. The front is going to get crusty. I already know that. Needs to be washed. We'll attack that another time. What? I'm trying to lower down the heat. My floor is so clean ever since it being clean i want to be better about not letting it get so dirty like it did my cuticles are dry what is going on Ooh. i do not like that hold on even with press on nails you gotta take care of your cuticles baby i'm loving this color and i know y'all love it too whether you do the long version or the short one it's just at the cutes the cutes ain't looking cute. What what do I want to put on my cuticles today? I'm gonna use this Fab First Day Beauty Fab Pharma Oat Hemp Multi Fix Salve. It's very pasty. And Z, you rub it on your cutes, and you can put this like let's say elbows, knees, ankles, <laughs> bottom of your feet. You know what I'm saying? Wherever you mad crusty and stuff. And then, and, you know, it'll take care of that. It's interesting because it made my nail polish look a little shiny, but that's all right. Then I just wipe my, yeah, it's nail polish. I wipe my nails on my clothes and it brings back, excuse me, it brings back the matte look of the nails. So look, they're looking a little satin right now because of the, the salve. <laughs> Rub it here. And then look, now they're back to being matte your the little things hi so i'm at, you know what bump this i ain't doing this i can't so we, we just gonna let it hang let it hang low we're gonna let it hang you know what i'm saying it's crusty that's just what life is about it's hot i have my heater on and i'm feeling hot in here i can't take it i can't can't do the hoodie <laughs> i'll turn my heater off though Ooh, laneige laneige whatever lip sleeping mask i have Oh, so many of these. This is the gummy bear one. Don't be confused and think that you can only use this at night. I just pinned back what was in the front in case you're wondering what's happening here. This is not only for night. What is this? Oh, this is not only for nighttime use. This is for, in my opinion, anytime use. Okay, so I use it all day. And that just is what that is. I'm editing right now. Final Cut Pro is acting up, so in order not to waste my time, I just happen to find myself on the Sephora website. <laughs> okay, so in my cart, I put in the Anastasia Beverly Hills Concealer. I've been seeing ads about it, and why not? I want to try that. Let me know if you've tried it or if you plan on trying it. Let's see what else is here. I also have some new fragrances coming on the way. I have this Caudalie Instant Detox Mask. I'm gonna use it and let y'all know what it what it what it do, what it's all about. But what else do we have here? You know, I never tried the one size. I haven't heard a lot from one size in a minute. Have y'all heard anything from one size? I don't know what that means. <laughs> I haven't heard anyone talk about one size. Like, not that I follow everyone on the planet, but I'm just saying. I haven't heard anybody talk about one size. Okay, medium, dark, golden, uh, maybe. The colors aren't always the exact colors. Like, in person, it don't be always looking the way it looks on a computer, and that's what's hard. Moving on, what else is on this site? I have no business being on this site right now. There's, I can't say that I need something. Someone asked me what the difference was between 
a beauty blender and a makeup sponge or a beauty sponge they're all the same see how it's called beauty blender makeup sponge it's the same but this is their trademark so you know they call it the beauty blender and we we a lot of times call all beauty sponges beauty blenders but the generic term is beauty sponge or makeup sponge but for that particular company which is called beauty blender there's called beauty blender you know so there's that look at this ysl got a new look tint new bear look tint skin tint foundation hmm. interesting okay what else we got over here ordinary paul's choice tatcha summer friday's lip balm according to andrea renee is the, that's giving laneige a run for run for its money what does that mean value sets do i need a value set i don't i would love to i want a ysl fragrance maybe black opium i bought black opium for christmas gifts last year and i really did like it <laughs> i bought a few and i was actually planning on keeping one to myself then i was like oh i need to get so and so a gift let me give them this <laughs> i wanted it oh i have seven virtues in my wish list hmm these are calling your name. I bet they are. I bet they are. And I wonder how that happened. Hmm. So tricky, these people in this algorithm. They're so tricky the way they do things. Lancome. Oh, I ended up finding, I ended up getting the Lancome on a discount from Macy's. Remember how they canceled my order because it was out of, sto out of stock? Yeah. I got it from Macy's, so I'm waiting on it. Lancome, what's it called? La Vie et Belle. Oh, God. Soleil Cristal. It is so good. Okay. is now i just decided when i was back in the office i used to have my lights like this and i forgot and then yesterday it dawned on me i was like let me recreate it I just filmed this look for YouTube. I wanted to do an eye look, but because I have on red, no eye look, baby. Red lip just needs to stand out on its own. I'm gonna link this dress for you because it's really cute. It's really, really cute and girly. Loving my hair. I combed it out with my situation, my what fabric softener situation. It just looks fantastic again. And now I'm going to the carpool line looking scrumptious baby listen i'm eating up carpool line looking like a whole different person it'd be so different it'd be so different every single day first of all it'd be different from morning to afternoon like for the morning time you don't even know who it is and you pick a time it's like is that your mom yes <laughs> i am her this is me i've just cleaned up a little bit you know <laughs> Hi. i wanted to film something else but i got started late today Monday really isn't my filming day, but I needed to film because I didn't on Friday or on the weekend. 
so I just had to normally Monday I've scheduled it where it's my relax admin type day whatever I have filmed one video it's better than nothing right you know so I'll just do more tomorrow tomorrow my goal is to film at least two be great if I did four be really great if I did four anyway gotta go pick up a baby from Carpool I just got this in the mail and I want to shout out Char. Is it Char? Valentine? Yo. I've been following her for a long time and she's been killing keto and she sent me this beautiful box of goodies. The quality of this book, I mean, I'm just blown away. The quality of the pictures. I imagine these are her recipes. Look at this burger. Turkey tomato burger. All keto friendly recipes. The book quality is out of this world. And just all of the details. This is not cheap. This is not low budget. You can tell that she put thought and energy and detailing into this stuff. I always love when I get small black owned independent business products and I can tell that there's been effort and quality put into the products. I always love that. I understand starting off small, do the best you can. I get that too. But I got to just shout out when it's done well. I mean, and this is not all that she sent. It was a whole bunch of goodies. I just finished eating the cookie. It was so good. And here's the book. Oh, let me share the uh, water bottle. Oh my goodness, the water bottle, so stinking adorable. Like, what is going on here? Summertime, does it say summertime? Summertime keto, like just, just out of this world. I'm so grateful. I really am. Thank you so much for this stuff, girl. Yeah, hey, girl. I'm doing some eye patches right now. I don't do eye patches nearly as much as I need to. Not need. I would like to. Like, why not, right? Okay, I tried this out for the first time. This is Black Girl Sunscreen. Tried this out for the first time on IG and in IGTV, and I loved it. People were so shocked at the amount of product that I used. They were like, dang, I don't use that much sunscreen. I know, that's why. <laughs> that's why I do the content, create the content that I create, because people need to understand, for instance, with sunscreen, you gotta take a lot. That's why you can't just bank on the sunscreen in your foundation because who's wearing a lot of foundation? Not everybody. The sunscreen does need to be a heavy amount. Four fingers is good, but with this, because the tube, or like, because the that opening is so wide, so big, I don't do four fingers. It'll be too much. I just take one big glop, and my face is white. But you got to work it into the skin. It is really true. This does absorb down to be ultra sheer there is no white residue it looks like it in the beginning but you got to work it into the skin and then it looks really good i like it i like for my skin with my skincare to look dewy i don't want my skin with my skincare to look matte so if you're like me and you want your skin to look dewy after you've done your skincare, then this is a great option. And it's Black Girl Sunscreen for the longest time. People kept saying, have you tried it? Have you tried it? And I just hadn't. I'm glad I have. I like it. This is a three fluid ounce tube. I think it'll last a great, well, you got to take a lot. This could last like maybe three weeks, a month. Yeah, I think this is fantastic. So, And, oh, it's for body and face, which is a good thing. If you use it on your body, it's going to go a lot faster. It is SPF 30. SPF 30 and above is where you want to stay. Anything lower, you're not even doing anything. You're doing nothing, you know? So this is great. You want to know something? <laughs> so in order to make my IGTV videos, like, really cute and whatever, I put on the head towel, this terry cloth type towel from Amazon, which is really good dries your hair in a, in a healthier way to maintain the strength of your hair. Now, underneath it, I started today doing this because I'm not always, my hair isn't always wet when I have this on. There are some times where, yes, I just washed my hair, so I have this on because my hair was just washed. But for instance, today, I did not wash my hair. So let me show you how it is on the underneath it. <laughs> oh, I'll let the robe and the towel down. So underneath it, I have my <laughs> my hair cap. And you may see me wear this often. Usually it's more on my face, but I just did my skincare, so I put it back. But what I like about this is that the inside is satin lined. Hello, satin lined hair cap. And it goes down. But again, I just did my skincare, so I folded it up. But it's a satin line hair cap, baby. It's looking real wild right now. <laughs> but what I love is that it's satin line. So your hair going to be getting all dry. And then the top is this cotton or what have you. And then I put this on top. You would have never known. You would have never known. <laughs> you know, some funnies. I don't know where that song came from. That was so random and so trashy.
<laughs> Somebody, oh, I got it. Who's at the door? Who's at the door? Oh, the donation people. They're finally coming. They're late. I put some stuff outside for donation pickup. They're late today. They usually come in the morning. Yo, so I wanted to film. Alexa, stop the music. I wanted to film like a few videos, but I don't have enough time. But I am going to just do my makeup. It is late. It's 1 30. I don't do makeup this late, but I took my time today. I wasn't in a rush. I was contemplating whether or not I should take a break or if I should to create content. And then the time just was the time, you know? And then I showered. I did do a few things. I did create a flower reel. Like my flower subscription came in. So I created a reel with that and that came out really cute. And then I did my skincare. So I used, I recorded that. So I did do stuff today, but I'm thinking more on my big camera. And then I'm like, you know what? I need to, I got my four again twice this week so far which I'm very happy about I really just need to stick to doing the things that I know make me happy because it's important my flowers putting them together cutting off the stems and preparing it in the in the vase made me happy the color is gorgeous I love it so much like what pink is my color and that hot pink Jay it's fantastic this has got to be glue so I just said, you know what? I don't have anywhere to go, but I'm going to do my makeup just because I know that when I look good, I feel good. So let me get dressed today. I should have gotten dressed earlier, but you know, whatever. Let me just go ahead and get dressed today. <laughs> uh, you know, like I do need to go to Home Goods. Maybe I'll go to Home Goods. I don't know. You know, I just, it's just important. It's just important for us to do the things that we know make us happy. I should have made this flatter. Well, whatever, it's fine. We gotta just do the things that we know will make us happy. It's different when someone else is doing something for us. That's nice. But when you do it for yourself, it hits differently, yo. It just hits differently. You have to set aside things that you know when you do them for yourself, you feel good. That way, this is the kind of stuff that nobody can take from you. Like, nobody can get upset with you and say... Well, I'm not going to give you compliments anymore because you acting up or I'm not going to go hang out with you because you are this. Like these are things that you have control over that nobody has control over that you can do for yourself every day if you wanted to. And I've identified those things. And when I identified those things, it's been a, it's been a game changer. It's been a game changer. It's just very important. I feel like it's very important. It might be the the aspect of my personality that likes to control but I do think that it's just healthy to have things that you've identified that you can do for yourself because otherwise to me and I've been there you find yourself unhappy and wanting something else or someone else to fix it no one else can fix it Depending on what it is, obviously. Like, I'm not talking about heavy stuff. Every single day when we wake up, it is not anyone's responsibility to make us happy. It is not anyone's responsibility to make me happy. It is not anyone's responsibility to make you happy. It is up to you. It is up to me to make myself happy. Right? And how do I do that? Spending time with the Lord, listening to worship music, getting a head start on my work, lighting candles. Oh my goodness. I buy candles more now than I ever have in my whole entire life. And that is one of the things that I'm grateful for as a result of the pandemic, right? Seeing the, the light, how do you say it? The light at the, whatever. Seeing the good and the bad. I've learned that fragrance makes me happy. My nose is very sensitive. So body fragrance. I've purchased more fragrance in the past two years than I have ever in my whole entire life. In my life growing up, I probably had two fragrances, maybe three. The rest were body sprays. But I just learned that I love to smell good. I love when my house smells good. I love when my body smells good when my hair smells good when I smell good my car smells good everything needs to smell good and that way it just makes me happy it just gives you an experience you know when you smell it's like think about it when the different seasons come around there are different scents of candles so you have the pumpkin and the chocolate and the marshmallow and the whatever and the mint and the hoo-hoo and the ha that signifies fall holiday season 
Then you've got spring scents like maybe lemon and florals and whatever else. You have summer scents and all the citrus and whatever, right? It signifies something. So I, I just want to create a life where scents remind me of something. And I want for our child to like know growing up and remember Oh, the house always smelled good. Mommy always smelled good. Daddy always wore his cologne. Even Nini at five is always like, Mommy, I need fragrance. Where's my fragrance? He wears fragrance to school every day, okay? He is the sweetest thing. He even appreciates fragrance because he sees that we appreciate fragrance. And it makes me so happy. Scents tell a story. Scents just make me feel good. I just love fragrance of any kind. That's just me. That's one of the things that I've learned that just make me happy. So when I get up in the morning at four and I emerge from my room <laughs> at 4.30ish after I brush my teeth and showered and changed and so sorry, brush my teeth, wash my face and change. I light a candle right away, right away, right away, like right away, just right away. <laughs> and then, you know, tidy up and blah, 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 blah. But yeah, I just wanted to share that because it's important that we happy ourselves we, so that we cannot, so that we're not relying on other people to make us happy. To me, somebody else making me happy or other people complimenting me or uplifting me, encouraging me is the icing on the cake. I, it has to be where I've already done all of that. I've already done all of that for myself. And then if somebody else wants to add to it, it's like, oh, thank you so much. I really appreciate that. As opposed to, here I am, wide open, vulnerable. I'm not saying to be vulnerable. But here I am, wide open, waiting for everyone in my world to make me feel good. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. It's too big of a burden to put on somebody else. Everybody got their own issues. You see what I'm saying? Everybody got their own issues. We got to all take responsibility for ourselves. We all got to carry our cross. We all got to carry all of our stuff and do what we can for ourselves it is not anyone's responsibility unless you're a child obviously it's your parents responsibility but you know i guess it's a certain point where you gotta pick yourself up but anyway enough for the long diatribe let me get ready i'm on hiatus i'm on hiatus Ooh. i'm on hiatus oh baby don't check for me taking time out 